Hello, today we're going to be discussing an idea for a new series and very much like the one of these I did for starting from scratch uh, if this generates enough support and interest the series will happen uh, so I'm just sort of throwing this out to you guys but uh, before we get into discussing what the new series I have planned is um, I just wanted to forewarn you guys about something um, as I'm sure most of you are aware I'm a, a uni student and there's currently two weeks left to the end of uh, this term, then we have Easter holidays. In the next two weeks, the last two weeks of term, I have three essay deadlines. Um, and then in the first week of Easter holidays, I'm going on holiday with my girlfriend. So this means in the next two to three weeks, I'm really not sure how much content I'm going to be putting out. Because like I say, for the next two, um, I'm going to be struggling with these essay deadlines that I'm literally, you know, uh, away for another week with my girlfriend so I'm just just for warning you guys I'm really sorry but I'm not sure how much content I can get out over the next sort of two three weeks however uh, when I get back from holiday uh, to make it up to you guys like I say I'm sorry about that but to make it up to you I'll try and churn out a whole load of content when I'm back to sort of you know compensate from the fact that there's not going to be that much recently um, the new the new uh Guard Codex, I think, is meant to be out on the 12th. Uh, please, someone correct me if I'm wrong on that. But that's the Saturday, uh, the day after I've broken up. And then I'm going away with um, my girlfriend on the Monday, which means I should get out an Imperial, you know, part one of the new Imperial Guard Codex review before I go away. And then when I get back from that, I will make sure I churn out more of more episodes of reviewing the new Codex. So, so. <laughs> So just to clarify, sorry that there won't be much content in the next few weeks, but when I get back we'll start you know, reviewing the new Guard Codex and I'll make it up to you guys. Anyway, I've waffled on about that long enough. Uh, let's talk about this new series idea. Well, basically what this is, is quite a few of you have uh, emailed me you know, privately or you've commented on videos saying, you know, whereabouts are you based? Because I'd love to play you someday. And... Um, what I was thinking was we do a Commissar versus subscriber series and what this would basically consist of it very very straightforward you guys just uh, email if you're interested and if we live in a similar sort of area come on down and we'll film a battle report together and we'll get a bit of a series going now some of you are probably thinking this is shockingly similar to striking scorpion 82's uh, challenge the scorpion series and you're right, it's exactly the same. However, um, I'm pretty sure no one's going to begrudge me that, seeing as there's absolutely nothing original about this idea. I've seen loads of YouTubers do it, um, you know, challenge the subscri you know, s versus subscriber series. There's nothing, you know, um, I could rattle off dozens of people who have done it. So it's nothing original about it, but I just thought it would be kind of cool. Um, so, yeah, if you're interested to have... Um, to be featured on a battle report on my channel just inbox me and let me know and we can maybe arrange something so a couple of things first of all you'll need to know what sort of area of the country I'm based in because um, obviously if you guys are from the north of Scotland or a different country or whatever it's not going to be practical for you guys to commute down to play me so during term time when I'm at uni I am based in Kent um, Canterbury to be specific and during holiday time when I'm back home at my parents house I am based in uh, West Sussex down near Brighton um, so I also better add that the fact that I am one of the few students I know who actually has access to a car um, I do own my own car so I can commute a bit further afield you know um, for example I go up to Essex to play Striking School in 82 and stuff so you know, I can do a bit of commuting um, so that's, that's about all there is to know, guys. If you live in any of those areas, uh, or you live maybe a little bit further afield, but you don't mind a bit of a commute, you know, or um, an area which I can relatively easy commute to, and you fancy challenging the Commissar, let me know. Drop me an inbox, and uh, we can get this series going. But uh, obviously, if there's not enough people interested, it, it, won't, it probably won't happen. The other thing I was thinking was, Obviously, because uh, I specialise in Guard and Blood Angels, I have a disproportionate number of Guard and Blood Angels subscribers. Well, I was thinking one thing that would be quite cool 
is if you you know if you're a big guard player and you don't really run any other armies, it wouldn't really make sense for us to do guard versus guard. So I was thinking maybe we could do something where suppose you've got five thousand points of guard, you can ally with me, we can buy in our guard armies and then do a big apocalypse game against someone else with a big army or something of that nature. Or e the equally with Blood Angels, if you've got a lot of Blood Angels, you can ally with my five thousand points of Blood Angels and we could do a big apocalypse game against someone. So, yeah, sorry this video has been a little bit all over the place, guys. Um, I just sort of thought I'd run this idea by you. So, just in summary, if you're interested, if you live in sort of, you know, the south coast of England or somewhere easily commutable, make sure you let me know and we can arrange some sort of game. Or if you play the same armies as me, maybe we could combine and do a big apocalypse game. Um, and then the final thing I'd like to note is uh, over the next three weeks I have loads of essays and then I'm going on holiday for a bit so content might be a little bit slow but when I get back off that we'll get knee deep into reviewing the new Imperial Guard Codex which I'm unhealthily excited about um, so yeah I hope you all have a cracking day I don't know about the rest of you but it's an absolutely stunning day in Canterbury today really really beautiful weather I hope it's the same way you guys are and um, so yeah have a cracking day and i'll see you real soon bye for now